Kim Il-sung was the leader of North Korea from 1948 until his death in 1994. He was born in 1912 in the village of Manjiongde, near the city of Pyongyang. His family was poor, and he grew up during a time of great political and social upheaval in Korea. As a young man, Kim Il-sung became involved in the resistance against Japanese rule. He joined the Communist Party and eventually became a leader in the guerrilla movement that fought against the Japanese occupation. In 1945, after Japan's defeat in World War II, Korea was divided into two zones of occupation, with the Soviet Union occupying the North and the United States occupying the South. Kim Il-sung was appointed leader of the Northern Zone by the Soviet Union, and he quickly set about building a communist state in North Korea. Kim Il-sung was an authoritarian leader who ruled North Korea with an iron fist. He implemented a strict regime of censorship and repression, and anyone who opposed his rule was ruthlessly crushed. He also implemented a system of personality cult, in which he was revered as a deity and his every word was taken as gospel. Despite this harsh rule, Kim Il-sung was able to maintain a strong hold on power for more than four decades. He was able to do this in part because of the support he received from the Soviet Union and China, as well as because of the fear and intimidation he instilled in the North Korean people. One of the most notable achievements of Kim Il-sung's rule was the rapid industrialization of North Korea. Under his leadership, the country underwent a process of rapid modernization, with the construction of factories, power plants, and other infrastructure. However, this rapid industrialization came at a cost, as the country's economy was heavily reliant on foreign aid and its people suffered from widespread poverty and malnutrition. In addition to his domestic policies, Kim Il-sung also pursued a policy of aggressive international relations. He was a strong critic of the United States and South Korea, and he supported communist revolutions around the world. This aggressive stance eventually led to the Korean War, in which North Korea, with the support of the Soviet Union and China, invaded South Korea. The war ended in a ceasefire, but no peace treaty was signed, and the two Koreas remain technically at war to this day. After the war, Kim Il-sung continued to rule North Korea with an iron fist, and the country remained isolated from the rest of the world. Despite this, he was able to maintain a strong hold on power until his death in 1994. After his death, he was succeeded by his son, Kim Jong-il, who continued his father's policies of repression and isolation. In conclusion, Kim Il-sung was an authoritarian leader who ruled North Korea with an iron fist for more than four decades. He implemented a strict regime of censorship and repression, and his policies of rapid industrialization and aggressive international relations had a significant impact on the country and the world.